Here's today's In Touch Devotion. Today's scripture reading begins in verse 22 of Luke chapter 8. Now on one of those days, Jesus and his disciples got into a boat, and he said to them, Let's cross over to the other side of the lake. So they launched out. But as they were sailing along, he fell asleep. And a fierce gale of wind descended on the lake, and they began to be swamped and to be in danger. They came up to Jesus and woke him, saying, Master, Master, we are perishing. And he got up and rebuked the wind and the surging waves, and they stopped, and it became calm. And he said to them, Where is your faith? But they were fearful and amazed, saying to one another, Who then is this, that he commands even the winds and the water, and they obey him? Have you ever fallen asleep on a long trip? Jesus did. In today's scripture passage, Luke tells us of the time that Jesus and the disciples got on a boat to reach the other side of a lake, and Jesus fell asleep. The next thing the disciples knew, they were engulfed in a storm, and the one person powerful enough to protect them was blissfully unaware. The disciples panicked and woke him. In John chapter 14, verse 27, we read that Jesus has promised to give those of us who are believers his peace. This is the very same peace that enabled him to sleep through a storm. Without his tranquility, we feel helpless and afraid like the disciples. But with it, we can experience inner calm in the midst of hardship. Believing in God's sovereignty is the key to a peaceful heart. In their panic, the disciples believed that a sleeping Jesus wasn't in control of their circumstances. But we must remember that He is always in control, even in times of difficulty. When we rest in the knowledge that God is in charge, we can exchange anxiety for peace. Jesus doesn't want us to be weighed down by fear. He wants to share His peace with us. Are you trusting in His control?